hello guys welcome back to mackenzie gaming so guys in today's video uh, i'm going to talk about a new game called track simulator pro usa so guys uh, what will be about this video what i'm going to do in this video is that we are just going to talk about the game what you should know about the game here i'm going to talk about all or everything you should know in this game so this is a new game as you all know but a lot of people don't know how to play it yeah some people say this some people say that that's why i've taken the time to make this video so this video is going to be about something like questions and answers i'll ask the question frequent question people have been asking then i'll answer them for you so the first thing we'll talk about is the name of the game so the name of this game is called track simulator pro usa track simulator pro usa this game is free and it's on app store and it's on play store so if you go there you get it with frequent updates so secondly the developers of this game so the developers of this game is magix so this that is the name of the developers of this game magix so the number of the number of uh, currencies in this game or the kind of currency that we spend in this game so i'll quickly go to the shop over here to show you the currencies in this game so that's it so you we have the gems over here but as for the gem section i don't know but i don't have anything in the gems so let me come to gem vault so you can see the gems over here as for me i have 115 gems there then we have the normal coins or the coins which is over here so that's it i have 143,567. then i also have research point so that's the research point over there then we have the last one called badges so guys i'll make a separate video explaining what each of this currency is being used for so all these currency have their uses i'll do a separate video and explain what they are being used for then now when we talk about the weather system of this game um we can talk about the normal weather we can talk about sunny weather rainy weather so these are all the kind of weather system you have in this game so le let me load into the in into the map and let's see the kind of weather we have right now in the game so that's the weather system so right now it's sunny right and i really love the weather system we have the clouds over here so le let me let me just move a little bit so right now See the weather is really over here with some clouds. So that's it. So let, let me quickly go back to the main section and let's talk about the tracks, the kind of tracks we have in the game. So I'm going back to the main section. So when you talk about the tracks, you have the Pizza Belt, you have the Volvo, the Freeliner, Cascadia, and the Western Star. So recent so um right now or initially in the game they are only four tracks which i'm going to show you when you come over here to the dealer we have the first one called the iron titan that's the peter belt the iron titan is the peter belt track which costs um when you want to rent it it's a thousand coin then when you want to buy it it's two hundred fifty thousand coin with twelve thousand five hundred what research bottles or they can do small chemistry bottles over there so you have the vanguard nlv three by six you know in this game the tracks are being divided into three by six and four by eight so they've separated them so we have the three by six and the four by eight so this is it so we have the free liner cascade which is a um which is a free liner casca cascade over here then we have the west track which is the western star so let me quickly go to the four by eight and show you how that one also looks like so this is the four by eight over here so that's it as you can see we have the four by eight and we have the three by eight so guys let's talk about the trailers so we have our trailer over here so we have the universal we have the freezer we have the wood trailer so this is a wood trailer over here we have the small container large container flat bed and each of them have what they can take those are written down here you have the hopper we have step deck so guys that's all for the trailer that's all you need to know about the trailer so the trailer can be the trailers can be rented or bought 
same as the track they can be rented or bought so guys let's go to the economy the economy part of the game so when you talk about the economy part of the game guys it simply means how to make money in this game how does money work okay so the way of making money in this game is pretty simple yes um take jobs or take a, any work a trip then after doing the trip you are being paid so you are being paid in the coins form then after that you are being given experience in order to in order to improve or to to uh, top up your level so as you can see over here this is your level bar at where your profile is so every job you do your experience is going to is going to top up that level bar so now as you can see i'm in level 11 yeah so another way of making money is doing challenges after completing challenge is a challenge over here so as you can see i've finished completing my challenge so it's waiting so every 24 hours you get a new challenge over here and it's very important to do the challenge because you'll be needing them to uh, complete one achievement over here it says you need to do 10 challenges to complete that achievement so this is my achievement section i mean chapter 19 then it says complete 10 challenges i've done it so i'm left with two more to go so it's very important for you to be completing the challenges so as uh, another way of get, getting money in this game is also what it's also doing challenges and completing the achievements as i said so as i complete this achievement i can get four thousand coins 5,000 coins. So that's how the economy works in this game. But I'll do a separate video explaining the economy or how the currencies are being used in this game. I'll do a separate video explaining it. So we won't talk much about it. Now, how are you being paid? Or another, uh, that, that, that will also be another topic. How are you paid? Or how do you get the job? That will be another topic for another day. So uh, I'll just say how you are being paid is being based on the tips. So on the trip, the how far the trip is. So let, let's go to the map over here. And the weight you are carrying. Huh? So I, I, right now, I have a job doing so. So unfortunately, I, I can't show you the machine so far because I already have a job doing. But I'm transporting uh, something from this farm here, which is a Tunasket farm, down to, the, down to Yakima. So... So guys, later I'll do a, a more detailed video on how you are being paid and how the money works in this game. So, um, can you can also take a job with your own trailer or a rented trailer. So when you rent the trailer, what it does is that any job that you take, the company is going to give you the job free for you to do. So the company is going to give you each trailer because you when you rent one trailer for example i rent the freezer trailer then any fish or anything that needs the freezer trailer that i transport the company is going to give it to me free i, I ain't going to bring my own trailer the company is going to give it to me free but when you buy a trailer then you need to be moving that trailer around everywhere you go so uh, for now i will i will advise you that don't buy a trailer for now but just rent the trailers so don't buy because when you buy the trailer you need to be sending the trailer everywhere you go everywhere you're going to send that trailer around but when you just rent the trailers then you can get your job uh, free or uh, i mean you can you can be sending your trucks everywhere you want without trailers and that to make your movability simple and easy so that's for the rented and the and their own trailers so i'll as i said i'll be making a separate video on how on how the economy works in this game how trailers and other stuff are being used in this game i'll make a separate video on that so now let's talk about how do i get the job so the way you get job is simple just discover cities as you discover cities so as you discover cities you're probably going to also discover companies so let me open my map over here so as you can see I've discovered all the cities. Every city you discover, you are going to get a white name of the city over here. But when you look at this Banyan Junction over here, you can see the name is very, very blur. This, um, but I've, I've discovered it. But I don't know the reason why this 
um, this is still very blur. I can't tell, but but all the other ones that I've discovered, you can see, you can see that it's very um, it's very deep. The white, you can see the white, but this one is a little bit timid. But still, I've discovered it, so I can't tell why. I don't know whether it's a bug or whatever it is. So, guys, um, I didn't even talk about the number of states we have here. We have, I think, four states now. For now, but there are a lot of states coming to the game. So we have Washington, we have Oregon, we have Idaho, and Montana. Then we also have the Wyoming over here, Wyoming. So all these states will be implemented in the game. So guys, as I was saying, let me see the final thing. Then we will be out of here. So the final thing is that discover cities, discover companies. So you can see we have a question mark over here in Clarkson. I mean, I've not discovered the company yet. After discovering that company, it will not be a question mark again, but it will turn into something like this, maybe a house. Yeah. So as you can see over here, so after when I after buying this warehouse, then I need to I need to upgrade it. So when I upgrade them, so I pay 150 badges. Use the badges over here to upgrade them. I'll explain what the badges are. So when I pay 150, it upgrades what it upgrades the warehouse. It means I can take a lot, a lot more, a lot more product. So after that, I buy the upgrade for the other slot, meaning I get a lot more orders. So now I have only one order because I've not upgraded the other slot, but I can upgrade the other slot to level two, level three. I get more order. Then the delivery slot is when you have your own trailers, but I don't upgrade the delivery slot because. I don't I don't go around uh, using my trailers. I just um, I just pick jobs with rented trailers, right? That's why I don't I don't upgrade. So if you check, you can see that all my delivery slots I've not upgraded, but the other slots I've upgraded them like this one over here. So I've upgraded most of my other slots, but I don't upgrade delivery slot because I don't do deliveries. I just do orders. So that's it. So guys uh, okay this is my other slot so you see i've in elizabeth i've upgraded all my other so but the delivery i don't upgrade them so that's it so guys without wasting my time i'll be ending the video here thank you for following the channel and um, all those who have subscribed thank you for subscribing if you are new to the channel too please uh, do me a favor and subscribe to the channel for me see you in the next video